Hey friends, this is Atif of Pure Val and welcome to the new update on Bitcoin. As in my earlier videos, I was showing you that on Bitcoin charts, on the weekly time frame charts, the Bollinger Bands was getting squeezed and I was telling you that at any time we can expect a big move to the upside or to the downside. Now, if we take a look at the live chart, then you can see that now after getting squeezed, the Bollinger Bands is now expanding and right now the price is once again dropped at the support of the Bollinger Bands. At the same time, you can see that the Bollinger Bands width indicator, the blue line of the Bollinger Bands width indicator is moving to the outside. This is something strange happening here on this seven days time frame chart. You can see that the blue line is moving to the upside from the support and the price is moving to the downside. And if we take a look at the previous history, then you can see that whenever this blue line starts moving to the outside, the price and also follow the signal and moves with this blue line to the upside. It was happening here. It was also happening here as well and here as well. But this time you can see that the blue line is moving to the upside and the price is uh, moving in the opposite direction to the downside and drop down at the support or the lower bands of the Bollinger Bands. And in today's video, we will analyze this move. And I would also like to show you this Bill William Alligator Indicator as well. You can see that the mount of the Bill William Alligator Indicator is completely closed. By the way, this is the combination of three moving averages. Uh, 13 and uh, 5 and 8. This green line is the smallest moving average that is called lip off indicator. And this is the 5 moving average. And this red line is the teeth off indicator. That is the 8 moving average. And this blue line is the jaw of alligator indicator. And this is the moving average 13. And right now you can see that these moving averages are uh, crossing down each other. Uh, we have the smallest one below all, then we had the bigger one and the biggest moving averages above all. So alligator mouth is closed. That is a very, very extreme bearish signal. But at the same time, RSI on the daily time frame chart is also entered the oversold zone as well. But before starting this analysis, if you are not subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe. And for more trading signals, you can also join me and support me as a YouTube member or as a Patreon member because there I'm sharing different trading signals for you. And you can find the link to join me there in the video description I've shared. And if you would like to see how my trading signal work, then I've also shared the link for the trading signal report for the previous month of July 2024 in the video description. You just need to open that report. And if you would like to check or verify any trading signal like this, the trade setup for portal, you just need to click on the link for the trade setup and it will take you to the trading views chart. And on this chart, you can see when I shared this signal like this trade setup I shared on 19th of July 2024. And you can also watch the complete trade setup as well. Like this is the buying zone and the sell target zone and the stop loss. And in order to see how the price line moved after sharing this signal, you need to click this button. And after that, it will show you how the price line moved up from the buying zone and read the sell target zone. Now, let me take you to the live chart of Bitcoin. And first of all, let me just show you the daily time frame chart. And here I have placed the Bill William Alligator Indicator. This is a combination of three moving averages, five, eight, and 13. And whenever the smallest moving average moves above all moving averages, then we have the bigger one and the biggest moving averages below all moving averages. That shows the alligator amount is now open. And that is a very, very powerful buying signal. It was happening here. And then we had a nice short rally. But after that, the price and again moved down. And it was also uh, happening here as well. You can see that when this Bill William alligator indicator was closed and again opened, then you can see that we had another very nice rally and it was also happened here as well. By the way, if during the bull run, Bill William Alligator Indicator closes its mouth, that can be a very, very nice time to find another entry to buy Bitcoin. Like it was happening here when we had the mouth closed here. And after that, you can see that we had a very nice move and short rally to the upside. You can see at the same time, the gas uh, RSI was also entered over so on. And it was also happened here as well. And before that, it was also happened here. This time, we caught a very, very massive rally when it was closed here. And after that, uh, certainly it was uh, again open. And after that, we had a very, very massive rally. And it was also happened here as well when it was reopened once again. Then we had a very, very powerful rally. And this time, if we take a look at the current situation, this can be an ideal situation to start another reversal move from here because at the same time, you can see that RSI has again enter the oversold zone while we have completely broken down these moving averages by the way at the same time if the price and starts the correction move to the outside from here and at the same time these three moving averages can also work as a resistance for the price line as well now if we take a look at the weekly time frame chart then here uh you can see that 
uh, Bollinger Band was uh, previously squeezed. And now it is expanding. And before that, when it was squeezed, you can see that it was trying to break out this basis, this blue line of the Bollinger Band. For a while, we broke it out, but again, we moved down before hitting the upper bands of the Bollinger Band. And now we are again dropped down at the support of the Bollinger Band. And the most important thing over here is that now it has started expanding. You can see that it is once again expanding, like previously, it was expanding here. Then we had a very, very major move to the outside. Before that, by the way, previously back in the month of September 2023, when Bollinger Bands was squeezed and the price was dropped at the lower bands of the Bollinger Bands. At the same time, you can see that the Bollinger Bands bridge indicator, this blue line of the Bollinger Bands bridge indicator was dropped down at the support. And when this blue line started moving to the outside, the price and also followed this signal and moved up with this blue line. And it was also happened here as well when it was squeezed here. The blue line started moving to the outside and then price and followed the signal and started a very massive rally. This time you can see that the line is uh, starting moving to the upside. But at the same time, if we take a look at the price line, that is moving to the downside. It's, it is going in the opposite direction. That is a bit strange happening on the seven days time frame chart right now. This is the signal that this drop can be a short term. And eventually the price end can start another direction move or start another reversal move to the upside. And this time, again, this blue line can break as a resistance for the price. And right now, by the way, the basis or this blue line of this Bollinger Band uh, is moving at $64,300. And obviously, it is also moving to the downside. And when the price end will be moved up, for example, if we will have another reversal move to the upside from here, then it can work as a resistance once again. And for example, if it will be moved uh, somewhere here, then we may see this resistance of uh, basis of the Bollinger Bands approximately at $61,000 or $60,000. Right now, you can see that the price line is also about to test a very, very strong and long-term key support of $48,000. We need to keep an eye on this support. And this support has been, by the way, previously breaking as a resistance here. And recently, it had been working as a resistance here as well. Therefore, again, it can work as a very, very strong support. Now, we need to keep an eye on this support of $48,000. And we will also need to keep an eye on this uh, uh, Bill Williams alligator indicator as well. If these moving averages will again start moving to the outside, and we will see another bull cross between these moving averages, and the mouth of the alligator indicator will be once again open, and RSI turns bullish, then we can expect that soon. The price end can also break out these moving averages as well, and we may see another upward move to the upside. However, if this support of $48,000 will be broken down, then sell pressure can be increased. And a big move that I was telling you is about to happen on this seven days time frame chart when it was quite squeezed. This Bollinger Band was quite squeezed. I was telling you that now we can expect a big move. That move can be to the downside. However, we need to keep in mind that. Uh, that on a monthly time frame chart, we have the formation of a very, very huge cup and handle pattern and a very massive Elliott wave structure as well. For that, a few moments ago, I shared another video. We can, you can also watch that video as well. So this was the update so far. I hope that you've liked the analysis. Then do hit the like and do subscribe to the channel as well. And for more trading signals, you can also join me and support me as a YouTube member or as a Patreon member because there I'm sharing different trading signals for you. And you can find the link to join me there in the video description I've shared. Take care. Goodbye.